Hello, <laughs> it's me again, Allie Green. This is my second video where I'm talking about my workshop series, Embrace Your Inner Space, an Embodied Perspective to Pilates. And I wanted to do these workshops because I could tell you, hey, I'm a Pilates teacher and I'm a yoga teacher and I'm a somatic movement educator and I love teaching movement. And hey, by the way, I use embryological education, somatic practices. I use embodied anatomy and developmental work in my practice and in my teaching. And the response might be, what? So I want to talk about what does all of that mean? That it's not this heady stuff. And in these workshops, certainly not going to stand there staring at a book of pictures or listening to me yak and yak. These workshops are highly experiential, meaning you are going to move. Now, you might be moving in ways that are new to you and there might be new information, but it is the, um, the value is in your experience so that you really find your own truth in this and your own uh, voice in this work. So I'm going to talk about the second video, second video, the second workshop, and it is called Heads and Tails. This is all about our spine, totally applies to Pilates. Well, better apply to like all movement, right? But we know, you know, Joseph Pilates, you know, you're as young or as old as how your spine moves. In this workshop, we are going to look at embryologically three layers of the body. Now, this is not in depth embryo <laughs> embryology. This is like just enough for you to have an appreciation of where things come from because that really explains a lot of relationship in the body. We're not these pieces and parts. So we're going to talk about the three layers of the body and they have fancy words. We'll get into that in the workshop, but we're just going to call it and what we end up calling it, you know, after we learn the fancy words is front body, back body, middle body, and our front body, because we can have more than one expression of our spine. What is our spine? You know, it's our midline. It's how we organize our body. So we can have lots of different ways how we organize if there's a vertical axis. So our, you know, we have our spine, which we know and love, and that's our middle body, the bodies of our vertebrae and our discs. And we have a front body, which early on was our gut tube. That has a very different quality of movement to it. And these are still present in our bodies. And our back body is the nervous system, the spinal cord. So we're going to experience moving through these different spines and then really blending them. And this creates balance. And the word I use a lot in, you know, in the workshops is tone. I don't talk about like, you know, posture in the way that we're kind of used to it. It's really about tone because at the end of the day, everything relates to, you know, gravity and space, you know, that's our support. And, you know, what's my relationship with that? So we go through that and of course, we're going to experience that, that three body spine in Pilates exercises. And then we're going to keep going and we're going to explore the rib cage, which is a really interesting area of the body. You know, those bottom ribs and that bottom part of that spine are, you know, connecting upper to lower body. There's a lot that goes on there. And when we have that understanding of the rib cage and how it's relational and also out through the arms, which is another one of the workshops we're doing, we are going to find a lot more integrity and integration in the body. So that is the heads and tails workshop. Sounds fun, doesn't it? <laughs>